everybody, I am Kayla with Cafe Crashdown, an awesome crash hub for all of you fellow horror nerds and sci-fi aficionados out there, um, where we just kind of geek out. We talk about horror films, we talk about sci-fi, we, we talk about whatever we want here, okay? Don't be dissing. Today's episode on Cafe Crashdown, we have news coming out. Comic-Con just happened and trailers have been dropping like freaking hotcakes around here. Um, so I am so excited to dive in and yeah, let's get started. Okay, so first on my list that we are here to talk about, we have IT Chapter 2. The trailer has finally dropped. Ah, I'm so excited! So I was really nervous about the whole revamp of IT because freaking love Tim Curry and you know Stephen King's my bae and you know just with remakes like you just never know nowadays I mean Pet Cemetery, god ah I'm still cringing about it but it chapter one really surprised me I actually really loved it I mean obviously there are elements of the original um, that I really love more and blah 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 but I really loved this uh, chapter one and so it chapter two i've been waiting and waiting waiting and a couple weeks ago we got that like creepy little teaser trailer with like the old lady and jessica chastin's characters in there and it was like straight up we were watching a scene out of the movie i was really genuinely nervous watching it at my computer i'm like oh oh like we're like watching the movie right now I'm like what's what's gonna happen you know um so i was really nervous and it totally has some of those creepy little, little elements going on so we have that awesome little teaser and then th Finally, we have the trailer that drops, and oh, I cannot wait. I mean, we've got such a stellar cast, like James McAvoy, Jessica Chastain, like I said, Bill Hader. I mean, some of these guys are just like huge giants, and it's so cool to see them actually want to be part of this project together and to make this happen. Bill Skarsgård, hey baby. Yeah, all the kids in the Loser Gang, they're grown up, and they find themselves back in Derry, and what do they find? Kids are turning up missing again, and it is back and he is back with a vengeance, man. He is pissed at what those kids did to him and he is out for blood. And so, yeah, I'm super excited. The trailer was great, the visuals were stunning, and so I can't wait to see what they do with this uh, chapter two. Woo, free baby! Woo, woo, woo! Three from hell, guys. It is finally released, the trailer. Oh, I've been waiting for a long freaking time for this. Rob Zombie. You've been driving this nuts, man, okay? Um, <laughs> if you don't know what I'm talking about, well, A, local boogeyman. This shirt is super awesome. And this one as well, which I'll be talking about in a few. Um, but Three From Hell is the third installment of this crazy zombie trilogy. Um, I say zombie, it's like Rob Zombie trilogy. Um, you had the first one, which is House of Thousand Corpses. Then you had Devil's Rejects. And in Devil's Rejects, I honestly had no idea how he was going to continue on with the story because straight up, our main characters are in this convertible at the end, just guns blazing, they're shooting every freaking gun that they have, and then the cops are just shooting at them, and they're getting bullets here and here and here and here, and like, they're just getting like annihilated with bullets, right? So like, there's no way that any person should survive that, but our three, obviously from hell, somehow survived this crazy situation so and it's sh showing from the trailer we're diving right into that we're talking about like how these three people actually survive um we're in jail with them and then somehow they break out who knew right um so they break out and they're out in the world and they're causing chaos and murdering people you got richard break in there and i'm, oh, I'm so excited for him to like be part of the team the like kill team gang boop, boop. Um, so yeah, the visuals were super cool. Um, it's always great seeing Sherry Moon and um, Sid and Bill Mosley, and I cannot wait. Ever since Rob announced this, I've been stalking all of them on Instagram, and <laughs> I've just been waiting and like waiting for any little nugget and crumb that they like want to draw for like a picture or whatever. So yes, that is coming out this fall, this September actually, and I have tickets. So Joel, who reviews movies with me here, um, we are going to go see it together. I don't know how many, he said he's seen a Rob Zombie film, I don't know how many he's seen, um, but I will make sure that he watches the first two before we go. 
Um, yeah, and we're gonna totally dive in and dissect that awesome film for you guys. Can you guys tell that I'm like super jazzed, right? Like, oh, so much good news this past month. Ah, I'm so excited. And here we are. We got Creep Show coming out, finally. Oh. I can't wait. And what's really exciting, guys, this is a Shudder exclusive, and you know how much I love Shudder. So, yes, we have Creep Show that is finally coming out. We saw the trailer at Comic Con. Holy moly, bajoli, I'm super stoked. So, if you don't know what Creep Show is, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be fine. Just catch up. Okay, so if you haven't seen Creepshow before, I'm over it, I'm fine, I'm moving on, and I'm gonna tell you about it. So it is this 80s anthology that George Romero and Stephen King came up with. And kind of the whole like overall premise is like, you have this like little kid who's bullied and like parents suck, you know, it's like, ugh, life sucks, meh. So he escapes through his comics and the stories in his comic come alive um, for him. Um, yeah, it's an anthology series. So Greg Nicotaro from The Walking Dead, he's produced The Walking Dead and directed a lot of episodes, a lot of like major iconic episodes. He took this on as his project, which I'm really excited about. I have a lot of faith in him because I've loved the work that he's done. We've got Tom Savini that's directing, David Bruckner from uh, Ritual and VHS. He's directing like three episodes. Um, I mean, you just got it like a killer team working on this. Um, writer Stephen King and his son Joe Hill are writing on this so I just know that this is gonna be super awesome the trailer was great oh my gosh I like totally freaked out at my desk at work and people are like what's wrong with you I'm like oh my god it's creep show uh, so um, yeah so it's coming out it's gonna be on Shutter. I will keep you posted and let you know and hello of course we're gonna be talking about it when it comes out I'm gonna be reviewing it and oh yay so you've got three from hell it coming out chapter two you got creep show also got dr sleep coming out Holla. another stephen king and it's actually a continuation off of the shining oh so i will not say more because it is really exciting and to kind of see where these characters have come from after the events at the hotel i mean like i said things are flying in and i know that i've missed some things but, but like all of this news guys like come on it's just like oh I can't keep up but really exciting okay so you guys got a little bit of the horror news going on and I just kind of wanted to talk to you about some things that are coming up here at Cafe Crashdown of course every month we are still doing our top five shutter favorites for the month Joel and I who have done the movie reviews for us and for Pet Cemetery, we are going to be reviewing Nosferatu if you don't know what Nosferatu is Get on the computer, look it up. It's on AMC and it's actually gonna be moving to Shudder as well as the Shudder exclusive. Um, so you can totally dive in with us and dissect each episode and just just talk about it. Totally check that out. We're still gonna be doing movie reviews because obviously we've got a lot coming out and I cannot wait. We have the Twilight Hour episodes, which is us. It's basically a podcast and we are doing voiceovers of our, some of our favorite haunted horror comics. We're still going to be doing special effects makeup tutorials and our first one is going to be coming out. So I can't wait to share that with you guys. It was super fun. Yeah, a lot is going on here at Cafe Crush Down. And I just want to say thank you to all of you who have subscribed and are still hanging out with us and watching our content because it means a lot to me um, to be able to hang out with you all and just kind of geek out and talk about the things that we love. Um, hashtag Havoc, you were awesome. Thank you, buddy, for watching my videos and I hope that you watch more and stay with us. This fall is gonna be killer. Not literally, but it's gonna be super killer and I can't wait to share all this content with you guys. So yay! And if you haven't already, you should totally click to subscribe because I just gave you a huge list of everything that we are going to be doing here and why would you want to miss that? I mean, come on. That's super fun, right? So click that little subscribe button. Click also the little bell notification thing and then that way you get alerted when we actually put up a video because each week we put up content. It could be one video, it could be two, it may be three depending on how crazy we are here. I don't know. But you're gonna have a lot of content to watch. So, get subscribing.